Run away on Thursday morning last from the subscriber, a mulatto man named Tom Brooks, aged 30 years, about 5 feet 8 inches high, strong made, had on a mixed brown coat and waistcoat, green trousers, a white beaver hat with broad gold lace, speaks English and French perfectly, was in company of one Richard Sutton, by trade a carpenter, who had on a blue jacket, a pair of white trousers, and new hat. Whoever secures the said mulatto or Sutton, so that the subscriber may be informed of it, shall have a reward of five pounds. Robert M. Guthrie, Quebec, September 22nd, 1785. This is the only ad in which both first and last name of the person was used. A lot of times um, the enslaved people were only called by one name, and it's a lack of respect, really. It's um, showing that disregard for them as people. In a sort of a 21st century person living in Toronto, if someone has that outfit on, it's a Blue Jay fan, I thought it would be kind of funny to have this person in a blue jay jacket with a new hat. You know, this, this brings it very much into the Canadian realm if this photograph is seen anywhere. It's the only piece we did where there's a very distinguishable sort of iconic uh, logo that you can now point it that it is a Toronto, a Toronto piece.